So electronics, um, electronica this year we've got we have got two booths, um, and this is the, the, se the second of a booth that we are looking, which is a, as a an open concept, which is um, um, showcasing new technologies um, and also um, showcasing some e-commerce platforms to for new customers. Um, the showcasing of our technologies are based on four different. Um, um, uh, campaigns or segments. We have uh, power, industrial power as one, and uh, we have automotive, uh, smart driving, uh, we have um, uh, um, smart, we call smart, which would be very much the IoT, the Internet of Things, and then embedded, uh, and embedded would then be the area that would be most classically linked to um, Industry 4.0, where we're talking about smart, smart factory, smart automation. Um, but what you can see then, this is choice of four, um, is that they, when you talk about Industry 4.0, there's a lot of crossover um, with some things like that. So industrial power, when we're talking about in, uh, our, the big industrial power customers, would also be the same customers that are, that are interested in, in Industry 4.0. Yeah? Um, so what we're showcasing uh, specifically here is um, predictive maintenance. Uh, we have a predictive maintenance um, 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 that we've worked together with our partners, uh, Infineon and ST, uh, primarily, uh, but also some, uh, some other suppliers as well. Um, and we're just showcasing a, a demo that we've uh, developed with them um, this year. Um, there are, um, that's probably the, sing the single one, but there are so other things that are also linked to here. Actually, to be honest, the, can the concept before that the, um, we have one booth in, in uh, C3, which is, is um, for our um, traditional customers who can come and they can uh, have a, a plan meeting with us um, and that's it's, it's always important that's part of it the relationship with um, with customers but what we when it comes to te new technology we want to share that new technology across uh, for, for new customers as well uh, so you can see the the, the, the booth concept very uh, very open uh, very welcoming for new customers so where we were showcasing uh, in each of the four areas four working demos uh, to try and um, document some of the, the, the technology advantages that have been done um, in this area. Our advice to UK manufacturers is, is ultimately, I suppose, I would say also talk to us, talk to, to, to um, uh, market participants such as Rutronic, um, because the standards at the moment are still not being set at the moment, yeah? And actually the standards um, in the end, in this industry 4.0, will probably come out of a um, a European standard conversation, so I think Germany, France are, are clear, and the UK are clearly uh, part of uh, de uh, developing that um, European standards. Uh, the standards also in the US, so the US come at this in slightly different things, they even call it, um, I think it's uh, industrial, uh, uh, I think it's actually industrial IoT I think is there, they actually have a different name for it as well sort of thing, but you can see it's a different way of thinking about it, often linked to, to kind of Intel, which we also have on the booth with, with Intel as well, so very much the American uh, manufacturers pushing the American technology. Uh, and lastly, um, um, which I'll also let my colleagues say, is China. China is clearly going to be a big player in this area as well, and they are going to be looking to, to set their standards. And look, you know, they, they've got big plans in terms of uh, is it China 2025 in yeah, terms of and these and these. This is very much part of their their belief. So I would say the UK, you need to be. The standards are being set at the moment, um, and the, I would say talk to us. Um, and we can share you um, our knowledge of what, what's going on at the moment and where we think uh, the likely uh, standards are going to be. Regarding uh, Industrial 4.0, uh, I think uh, uh, China also uh, is very uh, focused on this. Uh, definitely, uh, the, the terms we are using is a, a little bit different, but uh, more or less it's the same as uh, the basic of uh, Industrial 4.0. Yeah. Uh, they call the Industrial 2025. But uh, uh, regarding uh, the UK manufacturer to um, to China, I think it's very important because uh, I think uh, right now uh, China is getting more important to cooperate with uh, European company for develop this kind of uh, technology and apply in the uh, industrial 4.0 for China as well. Yeah.